Yeah, and Al, this is the second time that Jonathan Horton has won an American Cup here in Jacksonville. What is it about this town that brings out the best in you? I don't know. It's a great crowd. It was, you know, a really exciting day. It was, you know, a little rough for me uh, all over the place. You know, I didn't have the most time to prepare for it. Well, talk about that. How does this work? You said you only had two and a half weeks of full workouts before this competition. How do you come out here and win then? And you beat a guy who landed above you at the podium at Worlds. I'll tell you exactly how I did it. Uh, I, I consider myself a guy that lives by faith. And, uh, you know, I kept praying all day. I was like, God, get me through this. I'm not in shape right now. Uh, trained for two and a half weeks because I broke my thumb about two and a half months ago. And uh, he gave me the strength to get through everything. So I couldn't be more excited to, you know, have landed everything. And didn't fall, but it was a little sloppy here and there. But I'm happy with it. Did you know how close it was going into that last rotation? I did. I, you know, I was watching the scores the whole time. And, I even left out a skill on high bar. I was too tired, but I was like, I know how close it is. I don't have the energy to do it. Hopefully what I'm doing right now is enough. So 510 days to London. Has the march begun for you? The march began a long time ago. So uh, I mean, I, I've got so much work to do. It's going to be here before I even know it. So um, you know, I just want to go home, polish my routines, and, uh, and do everything that I can. I want to be able to walk away from this next Olympics and know that I did everything possible. Congratulations and best of luck. We look forward to seeing you down the road. I appreciate it. Thank you. All right, back to you, Al.